close your eyes and watch your breath coming in and going out. When it comes in, know it's going in. When it goes out, know it's going out. Just stay right there. You don't have to do anything else right now. All your other re responsibilities and burdens, you just put them down. And the other thoughts that come up in the mind, you let them go. You don't have to check out the constant email your mind is sending. A Fortunately, the email of the mind is not like email outside. It doesn't pile up. So whatever thoughts come through, you just let them go. Let them go. Because you have to look at the mind. The mind gets used all day long, and yet we very rarely stop to check and see how it's going along. If it feels tired, so we go rest. If, it's, if it feels irritated, we try to do something that it likes. But what it likes may not necessarily be what's good for it. Sometimes the things that it's like are going to make its diseases even worse. It's like having a cold. If you like milk, oh, that's too bad, because you can't have milk while you have a cold. We've got to look at the mind's diseases. We all have our mental illnesses, but they're not, fortunately they're, they're not the kind that will send us off to an insane asylum, but they are serious enough that they can cause a lot of suffering in life. There's the illness of greed, and there's the illness of aversion, and there's the illness of delusion. And it's the meditation that is the medication, which the, the medicine that you need in order to deal with these diseases. Because when the mind is still, it gets a lot clearer, and then that helps see through its delusions. The things you used to think were black and white, now you begin to realize, because they have their different colors. Things that used to be blurry to you suddenly get clear. When greed comes up, you realize that this is something you really don't want to go to. It's a disturbance. It's not going to lead you to any happiness. It's the same with aversion. No matter much, how much you'd like to engage in your anger in the past, you realize that it really does cause a lot of harm. This is how the meditation helps to clear away your diseases. So make sure that you look after the mind every day. Treat the mind every day with mindfulness, treat it with alertness, concentration, and discernment, based here on the breath. Because that's the only way you're going to get past these diseases. And it's only when you pass these diseases that the mind can really have a sense of well-being. 